हरे कृष्णा कमिटमेंट इज इमोशनल इन्वेस्टमेंट अटैचमेंट इज इमोशनल डिपेंडेंस फॉर ऑल ऑफ अस इन आर रिलेशनशिप्स वी हैव टू बी केयरफुल अबाउट मेंटेनिंग द थिन लाइन बिटवीन अटैचमेंट एंड कमिटमेंट when how do we know what is the difference between the two we don't want to be attached because then people will manipulate us and then we will get distracted because of people but at the same time we have responsibilities and we need to be committed so what is the difference between the two essentially it is in terms of how our emotions uh, function in within the dynamics of that relationship if we are emotionally dependent on someone that means we can't live without the uh, approval and pleasure of that person then that is likely to be emotional dependence and that is unhealthy because then they can make us do anything and everything because we are attached to them emotional investment on the other hand means a commitment means emotional investment that means we do it's not that we are heartless it's why for relationships to be sustained the opposite of detachment of attachment would be detachment and that would lead to there being no sustainable relationship so we need commitment and commitment means that we are emotionally invested that's why we are concerned say if somebody is displeased with us somebody is doing something which is displeasing us they are making us do something which we do not want to do then we are definitely emotionally involved because we are emotionally invested we care for that person we care for that relationship but that doesn't mean that we are ready to do anything and everything for that person especially if they are doing something which is wrong which is hurt which is going to hurt them or eventually hurt us and hurt the relationship so when we are emotionally invested then we are able to care for people appropriately one example for this could be if a doctor doesn't care for the patient at all and the doctor might just do give an injection uh, to a patient at a place where they already have got some wound and the patient would suffer terribly and that would be considered a that would be considered almost criminal why cause more pain than necessary but if the doctor is so much dependent on the patient that if the patient says no no this injection will cause me pain please don't give me this injection especially if it is a child and then the patient doctor decides no no i can't cause pain to this child so i won't give him that injection then the doctor will fail in their duty so detachment and attachment both will cause the doctor to fail in their duty because being too emotionally dependent or being not at all emotionally involved commitment means the doctor cares for the patient that means the care for the health of the patient as well as the emotion of the patient but if there is a conflict between the emotion and the health the doctor cares more for the health of the patient than the feelings of the patient and therefore the doctor can act with commitment and the same applies in all our relationships krishna says that those with knowledge how do they function an aratir anabhishvanga पुत्रदार ग्रहादिषु नित्यम च समचित्तत्वम इष्टानिष्टोपपत्तिषु सो कृष्णा सेज दैट अरतिर अनभिष्वंगः दैट अ पर्सन इज डिटैच फ्रॉम वर्ल्डली थिंग्स सच एज वन्स फैमिली मेंबर्स नो दैट डजंट मीन दे डोंट केयर बट बिकॉज़ दे हैव अ डिवोशनल विजन ऑफ थिंग्स बिकॉज़ दे सी दैट एवरीवन इज अ पार्ट ऑफ द लॉर्ड and including these family members who are parts of the lord and who are in my care they are invested they care for them so that emotional investment is talked about in atma upamyena sarvatra samam pashyati yo arjuna sukham va yadi va dukham sayogi parmo mataha that is 633 in the bhagavad gita 632 where krishna says to arjuna that the the highest yogi is see the equality of all living beings and on top of that ye thamam prapadyante tam sathaiva bhajamya hum as all people surrender we reciprocate that means that if we are 
going to go toward Krishna, then how do we go toward Him? That as we surrender Krishna reciprocates, and that formula we apply in our relationships also. So if we are connected more deeply with someone, we invest ourselves more in that person. So we take responsibility for them. So deta- so attachment is disempowering, whereas in, uh, commitment is empowering. Commitment enables us to take responsibility and function responsibly, caring for others' feelings and caring for others' future also. Thank you. Hare Krishna.